Hello, I'm um, Susie from The Gift 202. I'm here to shuffle your cards for the next 48 hours. From the 4th to the 6th of December. Yes, 4th to the 6th of December for the collective. Spirits and angels, give us the 48 hours from the 4th to the 6th. 4th of December to the 6th. Next 48 hours. That's the hangman. Next 48 hours. Oh gosh, it's the tower. 48 hours, please. Spirits and angel guides for the next 48 hours of this weekend. Next 48 hours of this weekend. Next 48 hours of this weekend. Temperance, Page of Pentacles, next 48 hours for this weekend, please, for the collective. One's falling on the floor. I'm going to have to take it, I'm sorry. It's the Nine of Swords. Oh, the World, the Moon, the Six of Coins, the Queen of Wands. Why well, I'm doing a Celtic cross spread, I don't know, but that's why it's come out like that. The Seven of Wands, oh, and the Sun. Right, here we go. Bottom of the deck is the Ace of Wands. So, we have the Hangman um, and the Tower. Blimey, is it time, regardless of whether you're ready or not, to jump into, not jump into something. I mean, I don't, I think you you might be hanging around for something and the universe has got another plan for this. Something out of the blue, it's a new beginning. It's the start of something you're not expecting for this next 48 hours. And obviously the hangman is that self-sacrifice. You've sacrificed something. Maybe you've had to sacrifice something because the tower's come down, something else has happened you weren't expecting. Now you're having to take the time out, do something else, be very patient, uh, put your toe in the water, but don't go fully into something um, because it's, I think this is something that's gonna take a little bit of time. You might get a message from an earth sign, um, which you're not liking very much, is giving you worries, nightmares, sleepless nights. Um, until you sort this problem out, I think it might take a little bit of time um, to sort. It could be like we've got the world and the moon here. So it could be like it's something you've done before, something coming round to completion. But it might take the month of the moon to emotionally get over it. Um, secrets are obviously going to be exposed. You could have travel cancelled. Um Someone is trying to reciprocate to you, though. They might come, they might travel to you in these next 48 hours in the, in the night and um, tell you a secret and say, look, I want to give as much as you're giving me. Um, they find you very attractive with the Queen of Wands, or you might be the Queen of Wands, um, on your throne and saying, well, I'm not sure about this because I'm just sort of not even swerving a nightmare. I've just had a nightmare and now you're coming in to tell me that you want to reciprocate and give things to me while I'm up here on my throne. Um, I'm up, like you're, you're putting some kind of boundary up, but maybe they've got to step up to your level if they want you because the sun's coming in it's absolute victory and you're going to be joyous and happy and childlike and this new beginning obviously with this eight of wands on the bottom of the deck um is coming in it could be a new beginning in a business because you you're up on a level and um it's almost like you've waited too long something's crumbled to upset you enough to actually take do something maybe move maybe start looking at your emotions something's coming to completion and you're finding out about the secret of it all and maybe someone's coming in and saying look i maybe that, that was me in the past but now i want to give give you the same you were really good to me i want to give back and maybe because you've come through this tower moment and this knight of swords you're not believing it because it's 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 in the night time, it's under a moon, it's very confusing. Yeah, I would say confusing. 
with that moon. But you've got the sun up there, the sun and the moon. I'm right, you know, the secrets, the everything. You're you 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 will be by Monday um, on a on another level and a new beginning, going into the sun like with the sun on your back this 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 childlike kid on a horse is so joyous it's a leo card it's your heart with a new beginning but i think because you stood your boundary and guarded your heart a little bit um i'm not saying don't let this person in because they are ready to reciprocate something for you but you initially there's this really hard time um a bit of a nightmare to go through but you, you're going to get help in the love realm and you're going to be very um, seen in high regard. Like they're going to put you on a pedestal and you're, you're feeling on a pedestal anyway. Just be very patient tonight. Very patient. Something out of the blue could be coming. So shave your legs. <laughs> I'm going to do the... Um, Romance Angel cards, Romance Angels, what would you like the collective? I'm not going to take them. Collective to know for the next 48 hours, Romance Angel cards, collective 48 hours. Collective. Collective 48 hours, okay. You deserve love. You are lovable. Release your ex. The time has come to clear your energy. Love yourself first. Self-respect makes you more romantically attractive. And soulmate, yes, this is your soulmate. On the bottom of this deck, we've got passion, I said to you. You might feel initially lost and like tired or whatever and, and something out of the blue might be like, oh my God. You might have to complete something. But in your confusion, something else comes in, reciprocates and makes you feel like you're on the throne, gives you your platform um and you feel joyous and shiny like the sun and faithful it's very godly the sun is god and it's faithful it's a new big passionate beginning in something let me ask the angel cards but initially you're hanging around just waiting too long and it's something's hitting the tower it's not very nice unless you need to complete something, get rid of it. Yes, you're well, in your confusion. Someone's coming in saying, I want to give you this. And you're like, what? This sounds good. So it could be something you've done before and you've got the T-shirt. It could be something that upset you before, someone, and they want to come in. It says, But it says release your ex. The time has come to clear your energy. No more sleepless nights, worries in the head. This is not. It's not a place you want to be. Especially with that tower there as well. It's like they're trying to promise you something with this page. You might get a message of promise. It's like, you don't want it. It's like, no. I'm, I want to complete that, that journey, that thing. I'm, I'm, now, I'm a whole person now. But it might confuse you. Scorpio card. What would the angels like the collective to know for the next 48 hours? What would the angels like? Okay. We have... Your emotions are healing, which enables you to open to greater love. I will help you release anger and un unforgiveness from your heart. That's exactly what that's saying. It's like something can make you angry, you're regretting something, you're getting over something. And then there's victory. So, yeah, your prayers have been heard and answered. Have faith. At the end of this 48 hours, you're going to be like sunshine. I'm telling you. Sunday, Monday. One more. One more. Next 48 hours for the collective. Please, angels and spirits for the collective. Next 48 hours for the collective. One more, please. Angels and spirits. Just one. One card. One more card. One more card. For the collective. Next 48. Okay. We've got two pink cards. Nurture. As you nurture a child, you nurture your own inner child. Both activities are important for you right now. Angel therapy. Give your cares and worries to us angels and allow us to take your burdens. On the bottom was it came out twice. Time out. You've been taking busy taking care of everyone else's needs, but now it's time to take stop and take care of yourself. 
So that's what I'm saying. Whatever news you get initially this weekend, try and complete it. Get in the bath, do your legs, do your face, whatever. And um, you've got the sunshine coming. And I think it's because you hold your boundary. You guard your heart because you are the queen of wands. The fire, the sex, the passion, the creativity. There could be something that you gain. It might not even be love. It might be some kind of new creative business, a new start of something, something you could be independent with um, uh, because you're nurturing yourself. Be around children if you can. Nurture them because it will really help. And it says your emotions are healing, which enables you to open to greater love. Release anger. I will help you. This is Archangel Uriel. Hope I've helped you, Collective. And I hope it, it was, what was the word? Resonates with most of you. And um, don't worry, the sun's coming out. Speak to you soon. Bye-bye.